It's a wonderful thing to be able to confess our faults and mistakes to God without judgment. But I don't think he desires for us to confess our faults to him alone. No, I believe the role of brothers and sisters in Christ is to be the hands and feet of Jesus in our life in a tangible way. If that's true, then what's one of the tangible ways we can be there for one another? Well, James says this, therefore, confess your sins to each other and pray for each other so that you may be healed. The prayer of a righteous person is powerful and effective. One tangible way brothers and sisters in Christ can be there for one another is through prayer and being a safe place to confide in. Now, I get prayer, but why confess our sins to one another? Well, if you've ever carried something around that you were ashamed of and then confessed it to someone, you know the healing power that honest confession has. This week, I want you to ask yourself these two questions. Number one, is there something I need to confess to a trusted brother or sister in Christ? And number two, am I the type of person people feel safe sharing things with? When we think about how much we are forgiven and loved by God in Christ, gives us the freedom and confidence to be honest with others and let others be honest with us. My prayer for us all is that we would be the kind of brother and sister that seeks prayer and help from others, as well as the kind of person that people can confidently and confidentially seek prayer and help from.